so as an interdisciplinary artist, um, you, as we said before, you got your hand in uh, many, many pots slash jars, whatever you want to call All it. All the jar pots. Uh, I'm curious to know how you fell into each one of these uh, disciplines throughout the years. Sure. Yeah. Um, I, theater was first for me. Um, I really, my, I had a mom who took me to a lot of different arts things and plays was one of them. And I really enjoyed watching plays. I was like a very shy child, actually. I think I'm one of those, I feel like I know a lot of people in performance who are like, I was really shy. And then I started doing theater and that was sort of how I became not shy. And I think I'm one of those people. Um, so theater came first. I started doing that around fifth grade and sort of kept doing it um, all the way till now. i um, doing like community theater and things like that. Even when I was in um, high school and whatnot, went to undergrad for theater, et cetera. Um, dance, I really came to in um, college. I also had this sort of story that I told myself for a long time of like not being a very physical person actually. Um, and and part of that was like I had asthma when I was younger and like struggled with like athleticism and a lot of the sort of like physical outlets around me were sports, which I was not very into. Um, so once I started taking more dance college the classes in college, I realized that that was actually like something that I am good at and was very excited about. So I had this sort of whole sort of like reinvention of, of like my understanding of myself that happens in college. Um, and circus was a little bit an outgrowth of that. I learned to juggle from a friend at a summer theater program at the Prince Music Theater back when it was still a theater before it when it was still a theater company before it just turned into a venue way back in the past um and then sort of like circus I really sort of just like picked up little bits here and there from different programs and teachers and different experiences with companies and then I taught for Philadelphia School Circus Arts um, in their youth program for a long time and through like connections I made there and classes I took there is where I got picked up a lot of my um, circus skills. So yeah, it's really been a like being motivated by my curiosity um, at every turn. And I feel like I'm still expanding into those things. Like my interest in interactive performance uh, really started around when I was like uh, moving back to this area in like 2014, 2015. So that's one of my like newest interests.